Richard, uh, Tidings, uh, this is Robin, my good friend. She is my secretary and she is the one that's put this uh, second annual uh, expo together. Jason is one of our premier guys here. He's the uh, <laughs> He's the most knowledgeable survivalist in our area. Hey, I'm Jason Drevenak from the North American Bushcraft School in Hedgesville, West Virginia. We are doing a fire demonstration this weekend at the Mid-Atlantic Survival and Preparation Expo at the Washington County Ag Center. Look forward to having everybody come out and see us start some fires with some sticks and some rocks. We're going to talk a little bit about the early, one of the earliest methods of friction fire that human beings harnessed. And this was the preferred method of fire uh, on North America. If you rub your hands together real hard, it's hot. It's the same basic principle. If you rub your hands together hard enough, long enough, and fast enough, you'll catch your hands on fire. The idea initially with fire wasn't to start a fire. It was somebody was using a stick digging in a log for food, probably for what are referred to as witchetty grubs or larva of the scarab beetle or something like that. Saw smoke, correlated the smoke with what came out of the sky and made fire, and realized that you could produce fire like that. That is considered kind of the grandparent of all modern types of friction fire. Along the timeline, this is very, very soon after it. This is real, real early in the early infancy stages of how we made fire before we had uh, uh, lighters and matches and things like that. The North American Bushcraft School teaches primitive skills, sustainable, and frontier living practices. Now, should I want to turn this into a fire, I keep doing what I'm doing. Very carefully, I build this up. You don't make a fire, you build a fire. We, we, we invite classes up to anybody and everybody that would be interested in coming and sit and visit with us. If you're interested in something, we invite you to come and spend time with us. Children are welcome, grandparents, 